Fate and God by Henry Kendall. Half fate and God, for whosoever lists to calm conviction in these days of strife will learn that in the steadfast stand exist, with scholarships the view of human life, was face to face with doubt, and now how strong his fuse must be who fights and fawns and bears, by sleepless nights and regal long and long, and many a woeful rave of wrestling prayers. Yet trust in him, not in an old man thrown with thunders on an everlasting cloud, but in that awful entity, and soon by no wild wraths nor bitter homage loud. And from the steward of some sudden step of speculation you have strength to turn, to things to boundless with a broken sweep of finer comprehension, wait and learn. That God hath been his own interpreter from first to last, so you will understand the tribe who best succeed when man must err to suck through fox the fatness of a land. One thing is sure when the autumn tints, we saw last week in yonder river band of that all our poor expression helps and hints her the vaguely to the solemn end. But God is truth, and if our dim ideal fall short of facts or short of we must weep, why shape specify source for the real be not the song which Erwell made us sleep? Remember, truth draws upward, this to us of steady happiness should be a cause beyond the differential carcasses of constant dogmas and mechanic laws. A man is manliest when he wisely knows how vain it is to hoard and pure and pine, but under every mystery he happily flows the finest issue of love divine.